and we are alive welcome welcome to global sources analyst choice wherein we talk about the hottest the latest the greatest and most innovative products out in the market i am rv and i'm gonna be your analyst host choice for today and we are gonna be talking about an interesting topic it's about wireless versus cable technology and joining us would be the modern creatures they're a youtube channel where and they review the latest and hottest tech gadgets. So they are Kevin and Vika, and they are going to be discussing that very interesting topic with us today. So stay tuned. And our guest verified suppliers are actually going to be introducing their factory to you, their cool products, and make sure to tune in and watch until the end. All right, so let's bring in our guests, the modern creatures. There's Vika and Kevin. Hi, guys. Hi. Welcome to Analyst Choice. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, morning. RV. Good morning, everyone. Who's How are watching? you guys? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, guys. So whoever is watching, please comment down below. Where are you watching from? And what are you interested to know in terms of cables and wireless um, tech? Yep. All right, let's get into it. So, wireless versus cables, Vika and wireless. Kevin. Here we go. <laughs> yes. Yeah, so, um, so, what are your thoughts about the wireless movement or the wireless lifestyle going on right now, especially in electronics, where in TWS earbuds, wireless charging devices are getting very more common, and also um, flagship uh, smartphones are actually mm. losing the headphone jack, therefore forcing consumers to go wireless. So, yeah, agree, right? So, any thoughts on this um, new lifestyle change? Well, the wireless movement or being wireless in general, it's really something that people are adapting to yeah. these days. Mm -hmm. You have wireless chargers, wireless audio peripherals, and it's really easy. I think that's the number one thing about wireless. It's easy, it's seamless, and you know, it looks really cool when you have like, yes, wireless <laughs> living the untethered lifestyle. Mm -hmm. that's true, so yeah. yeah. And if I just may add to it, um, starting from the word mobile, mobile devices, mm -hmm. it means you, ha you really need to be mobile while using it. So while charging, uh, maybe you can just put it there and can, you'll be able to work. Um, for your headphones, uh, just put it on without wire, without uh, cords. You'll be able to move around, go for a quick prepare your meal while you're um, attending, attending, I don't know, like yeah. an online thing. So we can, can move around. You can definitely more move around. So it's definitely here right now and it's we're appreciating it. We're using it. I agree on that. And there is such a thing as um, content creators, cable management when you guys work. So, um, you know, cable management is basically trying your best to undeclutter your desk. And um, wireless technology is definitely a big help. Like imagine like having your phone charger, wires and all these. <laughs> but then if you have a wireless charger, just snap on your phone and you're good to go. So, yeah, Kevin, um, you mentioned that um, wireless devices are good for mobility. So yeah. that's why there are wireless earbuds. Uh, it's good that's for people true. on the go. And um, one situation I can also think of is when you're uh, riding public transport, wherein you don't have to bring heavy wires. Yeah, because sometimes cables, they just don't work with you. They just magically tangle themselves up for some reason. <laughs> and right at that moment, when you just simply want to listen to music, you'd have to spend like five, ten minutes trying to untangle your cable and all that. So it's uh. really, it could really be a hassle, especially when you're out and moving. So in mm -hmm. those cases, probably wireless is your best bet. Yeah. Agree on that as well. Like cables have a life of their own. <laughs> <laughs> but um, but uh, aside from that, even though cables do have some their um cons, um, mm -hmm. what um on the other hand, what are their pros? What are their pros? Like as content creators, how have cables um made your lives easier and more um you know efficient? Okay. I would say that cable is still a necessity at in some point, especially mm -hmm. at, from a content creator's life. So basically, when you're shooting, when you're shooting clips and it 
it, it take a lot. You take a lot of shots. You shoot for like two hours, and then when the time comes that you're done shooting, you're gonna need to transfer them to a laptop or to a desktop. You're gonna need to use wires and cables because doing that like wirelessly, like uploading a, an entire batch over the internet, will take you like three, four hours just to do that. So it's counterproductive, counterintuitive. So you'd rather be better really with a webcam, uh, with a with a with a wired with a wired uh, devices. So um, in terms of speed and data transfer, cables are still the way to go. Definitely, definitely. Because um, they're able to transfer large amounts of data in just mm -hmm. seconds. So it's still the way to go. It's still the way to go rather than going for wireless and spending more time simply doing that. I see. Agree. And also, um, in your further experience as a uh, content creators like you do live streams in what mm -hmm. sense that you also use cables in terms of power do you go wireless when you connect your mic and plug in your devices um, what do you do for content creators we would um we prioritize stability and connectivity mm -hmm. um we don't we don't want like in the middle of filming will be will be uh, cut off uh, unintentionally so we prefer reliability that's why we still go for cables Definitely. Agree on that. And um, in terms of reliability, it's also a source of power. Like, for instance, um, going live, um, it's definitely safer to connect uh, with a cable using the mm -hmm. internet compared to uh, Wi-Fi, which is wireless. Sometimes it can mm -hmm. get unstable. So in terms of re re reliability, um, cables are still important. Yeah, so Hi, Vika. Welcome back. <laughs> so speaking of wireless dependability. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Sorry. Can, can you uh, proceed? Uh, okay. So, yeah. Um, wireless. Um, what's that? So, internet-wise, it's also safer to use cables in terms of wireless technology. Um, like you guys previously said, wireless is definitely convenient. Mm. Like, I mean, Wi-Fi, no wires. But then, in terms of stability, I think it's more important first to um, connect uh, yeah, via... Yeah, yeah LAN, LAN cables. Yeah. Like, I think people also forget that cables are also upgraded every year you yeah. know mm -hmm. like upgraded. land cables right right now can go up to 100 gigabytes per second i think something you still can't achieve fully when you do a wireless connection so if you're really dependent on um internet or you really need uh undisrupted yeah connection there you go wired, yeah okay. Especially when, I guess, sorry to, to interrupt, but especially when uploading videos, you do yeah. videos, so we upload like 8 minutes, 6 minutes to mm -hmm. like 15 minute videos. So if you're gonna rely on Wi-Fi sometimes, especially when the connectivity is choppy, um, you're gonna get, you're gonna get uh, interrupted all the time. So it's, it really pays to have a good LAN cable still uh, as, as much as possible. Agree, agree. So, um, the cables that are um, a necessity in terms of live stream content creation and also online classes, um, is yeah, online classes. Um, it's powered uh, cables, and then for internet connectivity, the LAN cable, and then also uh, data and charging cables for faster yes. mm -hmm. transfer speeds. All right, got it. So, <clears throat> so for the Another question is, in your opinion, mm -hmm. like to wrap this up, will cables be ever obsolete? Are they here to stay? Will wireless technology slowly replace cables in time? I, I think there are two sides to that, mm -hmm. two answers. If you are a consumer, yeah. let's say you're an everyday worker or an everyday student, I think adapting to a wireless, a fully wireless life, lifestyle is really possible and maybe a lot easier so imagine going on your commute let's say we mentioned earlier instead of having to fumble in your bag for wires you can just mm -hmm. easily put in your buds and there are some buds who can auto connect so you don't even have to pair it to your phone you just put it yes. in and so play really music convenient. right and then there's wireless <laughs> charging uh there's even a new technology out now where you can even wireless charge char wirelessly charge away from the wireless charging mm -hmm. so air charging air yeah. charging so Lovely. they're untethered uh and it's going to be really easy because you can move around especially in the work for home situation where you can be in a meeting in an hour mm. 
and cooking the next. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah. That's the consumer side, I would think. So that's, um, you're saying uh, it's still convenient for consumers. Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. But there's still uh, a con to that, if I may mm -hmm. add. Um, going for for uh, wireless connectivity all, all, all over your devices is a bit pricey. It could get pricey. Yes, thank uh, it you. It's like double or triple sometimes uh, the price of a, of a traditional device with, with wire. So, Cable, yeah, yeah. So, so, so price is one consideration. And another thing, maybe um, you're still going to experience delay or latency when you're listening to uh, wireless headphones. So you see yeah. my headphones right now still as cables because I like the music. <laughs> I like my nice lossless words. quality. <laughs> uh, I like listening to music as it is, as, as, a, as a whole sound. So I still prefer wired, cable, wired uh, headphones versus um, wireless. They could lose some detail, some clarity. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. it's not so bad. But if you're really particular about your quality, yeah. you, you still go for wired. So those are just some pros and cons for wired versus uh, wireless. Um, if I were gonna um, say it like this, it would be like, um, if you want convenience, go mm -hmm. for wireless. Yes. But if you want reliability, stability, and maybe affordability, um, <laughs> <laughs> go for go for wired, definitely. Very well said, Kevin. Uh, you summed up basically the uh, wireless versus cable uh, predicament. So I think it's somewhere in between. Each yeah. has its pros and each yes. has its cons. And speaking of the other pros and cons, I remembered uh, wireless. What can you talk about the speed of wireless charging versus uh, cable charging? Who you wins? <laughs> it's so hard. Honestly, mm -hmm. it's really what are the hard sides? now because... <laughs> Yes, you do. You're so accustomed to wired cables and they're so dependable and everything. But wireless is slowly catching up. I mm -hmm. believe that in a couple of years, prove me wrong, technology, <laughs> in a couple of months, <laughs> uh, we will have dependable wireless charging. I'm actually looking forward to it because I don't, mm -hmm. personally, I don't like having to be tethered <laughs> while charging. Mm -hmm. So. I'm willing to sacrifice speed. Yeah. Um, I would be the opposite. To that so what's your take on this? Kevin? Because for me, um, wireless charging only delivers so much power, so much voltage. Mm -hmm. um, but compare that to like wired, uh, wired charging, it could go right now. We have 65 watt uh, cables um, charging our phone. So we could go for zero to 100% in like 30 minutes. So that's really fast. Yeah. Um, when it comes to wireless, you'd wait longer you do it but definitely you can use longer. it you can, while charging um <laughs> that brings me to my next point actually <laughs> with a cable with a cable charger you can get your phone while it's charging use it make mm. a call share a post okay but when it's wirelessly charging it's it has to be on top of that uh charger yeah. that dock so you'd you'd be able to ch to use it still but you'd have to be like on top of that uh desktop or on top of the table that you put it on so with wired you can easily pick it up make a call so that's my that's my thing just wait <laughs> yeah yeah thanks for sharing that point as well you know um it's interesting to know the various situations mm -hmm. um it depends also on consumers which one they prefer but ultimately in terms of reliability and stability and definitely speed for now uh cable are the way to go yes. and then for convenience in general for easy you know connection no um no hassle wireless, wireless is the way perfect. to go and, yeah. Wow and <laughs> yeah, yeah yes wow oh wow yes like it's yeah it's a lot cooler to see like people with um wireless devices so um for the last question um what do you look forward further in terms of wireless technology? Like, what's that one thing? Like, uh, Vika, you mentioned um, you're willing to sacrifice speed. So, how much do you? How much faster do you want it? And then, Kevin, you mentioned the audio. So, how much uh, better? When can you say that wireless technology has indeed catched up to cables? Yeah. I think it's going to be a while for wireless mm -hmm. uh, to really, truly catch up with wired. It's going to be mm -hmm. a while. But that doesn't mean we can't um, benefit from the convenience thing, yeah. right now. Yeah. That's what I think. So I'm okay with living wired and wirelessly in hybrid. There you go. 
because <laughs> hybrid is for yeah because it's working i am that's the, one, that's the word <laughs> oh, there there you go same with me um with, mm. when it comes to audio i would prefer um really clear sound but you know yeah. wireless wireless devices now wireless headphones um they're not bad at all so definitely mm. i'm mm -hmm. i can be like in the middle as well yeah and today's wireless devices have good uh cancellation um is that That's anc true. there you go anc so, active noise cancellation yeah so um you know they're uh, stepping up their wireless audio mm. game yeah and it's becoming available in a lot of price more ranges. affordable yeah, yeah more affordable mm -hmm. so flagship to the budget anc is popping out everywhere it's agree it's it's a current trend right yeah. now that a lot yeah. of suppliers are um mm. going in because it's very oh. important yeah, yeah. And I agree on that. So um, I guess our topic has concluded to wireless and cables, living the hybrid lifestyle. Living the hybrid lifestyle. Best of yes. both worlds, I guess. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. That's correct. I agree on that. The best of both worlds. So right now, our consumers are still in need of both cables mm -hmm. and wireless. All right. That was such a good chat. Thank you so much, Kevin and Vika, for no joining worries, us no today. Worries. Thank you so much as well. Wish yes. we could talk more. Maybe yeah. if there are better Definitely. wireless better wireless devices yeah maybe next time for global services oh we are definitely looking forward to working with you again so just keep an eye on those emails and we'll see you guys soon thank you so much thank you rb thank you everyone have a good day everyone have a good day enjoy bye. the rest of the show thank you bye All right, so that was Kevin and Vika of The Modern Creatures. So that was a very interesting topic about wired versus wireless technology. And um, make sure to subscribe on their channel, The Modern Creatures, on YouTube. Feel free to click the link in the description down below. Okay, so now let's move on to our suppliers. Okay, who's excited to get to know our guest verified suppliers for today? I know I am. So let's bring them all in one by one here they are hi guys welcome hi. to analyst hey, choice hi. Hi. Hello. Yeah. hello hello Hi. Welcome back. Oh, yeah, so we are super thrilled uh, to learn more about your factory, your products, and manufacturing capabilities. So let's get the show started. Let us start with Alan and David of Shenzhen Do Top. So, Alan and David, please do tell us about your company. Give us a brief introduction. Okay, well, Ali and everybody, thank you, thank you so, so much. Uh, my name is David. My company's name is uh, Shenzhen Do Top Electronics. Mm -hmm. TWS Earbuds is our main business and the whole business for my whole life. Actually, uh, Ari, would you please just play the video first? Oh, you'd like to play the video first? Sure. Uh -huh. Let us uh -huh. play. So guys, um, as requested, Shenzhen Do Top wanted to um, introduce you guys to their factory so that they can elaborate on the video after. So um, let's play it. Okay, Hold thank on. you. Well, by the way, what you see here is 100% true what we have at our workshop. I mean, it's a true thing. This video is not from the internet. This video is not from anywhere else. It's only from the true DT company. 
it's the true saying, it's the true workshop, and it's the 100% true factory saying here. Thank you. Yeah, these are our uh, testing facilities and equipment. All right, so that was Shenzhen Dutop's factory. So, um, Alan and David, please elaborate further on that. Okay, because the video was played, uh, I we, we want to take too much time because we want to leave time to some other uh, mm -hmm. suppliers. Uh, basically, you know, uh, we are manufacturer here uh, with the capacity. At a, I mean, uh, annually, we ship out more than... 600 million pieces of the TWS for the whole world. Oh. I mean, we do the domestic market and the international market with here. We got two manufacturer bases. Our Han mm -hmm. culture is in Guanlan, Shenzhen. And the other manufacturing basis is the Hubei, Yichen. Um, yeah, basically, that's it. Thank you, Arvi. Thank you, everybody. Thanks, Alan and David. That was exciting. Um, your factory is really cool and neat and organized. So yeah, that was. Uh, thanks for Thank showing you. us that video. All right, so let's move on to Albert Wang of Skywing Communication. Hi, Albert. Hi, Arby. How are you? Hi, Hi I'm great. How are you? So tell us about your company, Skywing Communication. Hi, hi everybody out there. So uh, my name is Albert, uh, Albert Wang. So uh, I'm the director of business development at Skywing uh, Communication Electronics. So uh, at Skywing, uh, we are a manufacturer for uh, Bluetooth audio products, primarily mm -hmm. with uh, headphones and also uh, audio adapters. So in the same time, um, so we're we're actually uh, located in uh, uh, Humen, uh, Dongguan. So so in the same time. Um, so, and currently we have over uh, 1,200 uh, on-site staff, and we have been in, in, in uh, business since uh, 2003. So. All right, uh, Albert, thanks for sharing that info. So, yeah, Skywing has been around for uh, quite a while, right? Uh, very experienced since 2003. Uh, yes, definitely. I mean, uh, it is, uh, you know, good to be uh, in business. <laughs> Definitely. So um, I guess you've gained a lot of uh, um, strong business partnerships um, in that experience. Uh, long, You guys have a long um, history, so that's good to know. All right. Thanks, Albert. So let's move on to the third uh, supplier. These are Alice and Barry. Hi, Alice and Ferry of Shenzhen Diadem. Do, do Hello, please everyone. tell us about your company. Hello, everyone. Nice to meet you guys. It's our great honor to introduce our company to you guys and uh, to all the audience. And our company name is uh, Diadem. And uh, Diadem is actually a new company. Uh, it was founded in the year 2008. Uh, mm -hmm. We have uh, two uh, self-built factories in inland. Also, we have Diadem Hong Kong. And uh, here, we, uh, which we see this is our headquarter uh, located in Shenzhen Technology uh, Park. And, uh, mm -hmm. and also, totally, we, we have over 300 employees uh, all over China. Uh, so, uh, Dadan Group has been commi committed to the OEM and ODM development and production of mobile phones and smart products. After 12 years of development, our products has been exported far to Asia, Europe, uh, North America, Russia, South Africa, Australia, Middle East, etc. Our partners, uh, including uh, Acer, MTK, uh, UID, China Mobile, and uh, uh, and uh, American AT&T, etc. Also, uh, like the top. Uh, the top European top operator uh, like the Orange, 
is also mm -hmm. our uh, partner. And uh, our annual sales is over three million mobile phones, and uh, mm -hmm. and uh, value reached up to two hundred fifty million. Uh, and uh, uh, in uh, we our company was elected by the uh, China's largest uh, exhibition group called Global Source as the uh, uh, top twenty uh, most influential mobile phone mm -hmm. companies. And, so um, currently, we have reached a strategic uh, corporate relationship with German brand uh, Telefunken uh, and uh, France uh, Telecom's largest operator called Orange. Uh, so mm -hmm. relying on uh, all, uh, more than 10 years of industrial R&D and production advantages, um, we will uh, we are aiming at to develop into the domestic Internet of Things, smart home. 5G of a high touch leading company. Mm -hmm. So uh, we have our self built product lines and uh, our product, uh, including mobile phone, Bluetooth speaker, smart uh, watch, smart band, WS, earbud, etc. And uh, also, we have now been certified by Orange and MTN. So our daily capacity can reach to 30 to 50K. Uh, oh, is that yeah. per month or uh, per year? Daily, daily, yeah, yeah. Per so, year? Uh, per day. Oh, wow, per day. That's a lot, yeah. you guys. That's amazing. Yeah, so choose Titan. We will not uh, let you down. So thank you. Aw, that's cool. Thanks, Alice, uh, for introducing your company. So let's yeah. move on to Paul of... Hi, Hi everybody. Paul, you, you and I. Hi, Paul. Hello. Welcome. Hi, Abby. How are you? I'm great. Can you How hear are me you? very clearly? Yes, we can hear you perfectly. And we are excited to know about Guangzhou, you and I. So tell us all about your company. Yes, of course. Yeah. Hello, everybody. Yeah, nice to be here. And thank you for the Global Source. It gave us the chance to introduce some about our companies. You and I technology. Uh, uh, I'm the uh, uh, Paul, the CEO of this company. We founded this uh, company from uh, 2003 and uh, more than 18 years specialized in Bluetooth and audio only. Nothing else but Bluetooth. Mm, so very focused on uh, products. Yeah, that's good. Focus yeah, yeah. Well. We do all the things about Bluetooth, including mm -hmm. the Muno, including the car key adapter, and including the uh, speakers and the wire, stereo, wow. uh, until now. But from 2014, so we jumped into the TWS uh, earbuds. So mm -hmm. earlier than the airports. From that time, we focused on TWS earbuds only. So nowadays, we are the initiator, we are the drafter, and we are also the uh, framer of the TWS earbuds uh, te technical standard. So meanwhile, we are also the listing company in the China market share, uh, mm -hmm. share market. I mean, with stock market, we are the listing company. So mm -hmm. we have, uh, we already sold uh, to our products to over 66 countries in the world. Oh, that's our a lot. Of <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, our, our main market is Japan, uh, Europe, US, and so on. So we have more than uh, 100 uh, uh, SK, SKU and uh, I mean products uh, for the TWS. And now we have uh, 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 one hundred and more than one hundred and sixty engineer and more than one thousand workers and we have more than product line more than 40 product lines produced specially for tws bluetooth so we are not only manufacturers now but also we are the solution supplier with the technical technology supplier mm -hmm. rd supplier and the survey supplier so we, we would like to be the one-stop station for all kinds of TWS solutions. Mm -hmm. Not only the high-end, 
but also the mid end and entry uh, entry level. Mm. So um, please welcome, come to us and uh, with us, and we will give you a very satisfied uh, service and uh, results. Thank you. Thank you, Paul. Thank you. So that's interesting, right? So your company does not only provide products, you provide other services as well, which is important. I think as a buyer, I would really enjoy that, that I get other services aside from just the products. So that's good to know. All right. So for our second question, it's uh, probably the favorite segment of our suppliers. It's the show and tell time. <laughs> So you guys, um, please do share your company's best product, which you think the buyers watching right now should source. So let's first start with Alan and David of Transcend Duta. Please show us your company's best product. Well, thank you once again, Harvey. So cool. Um, well, you know, I just now I just uh, re received a WeChat message from one of my customers. He asked me, uh, hey, David, you are just on the screen. Congratulations. So I do believe there are some of our partners watching this uh, streaming show. Okay. Just Thank uh, you guys for watching. <laughs> just make a long story short. You know, uh, for my company, firstly, I'd love to tell everybody what's our core value. Core mm -hmm. value means core unit, core strengths. Firstly, we have co very cost-effective product lines. As I mentioned just now, every year we ship out more than six million pieces of the TWS. With this huge volume, we can optimize our production efficiency to the best. And in the meantime, we can beat the upstream and the downstream cost to a very competitive level. The second point, reliable quality. Mm. Because we have very uh, well-equipped and a complete quality control system to make sure every single piece of our product will be QC will be quality controlled, will be checked before shipping. Because, you know, like all the business, quality matters, especially Agreed. for nowadays, the e pleasure, the e marketing, the e business, right? People they care about the review. Good reviews bring us profit, bad reviews ruin our credit. Agreed. The third point about our core value is uh, our super strong research and develop capacity. Yeah, in other words, we have very strong R&D capacity because in this business, we've been here for more than five years and here we got 30 engineers team including ID, including software, hardware, uh, construction, and so on. I mean, the very strong R&D team to enable. We have very strong R&D capacity. Well, specifically, what kind of product line we carry? Uh, basically, we carry two product lines. The first product line is high and premium end product lines, which based on Aeroha chipset, targeting at the high marketing level for this price affordable people. Like this product, our mm -hmm. item 98. Yeah. That's an ANC TWS. Mm -hmm. with features like three mic ANC for music and ENC and ANC. light sensor. Light sensor means turn switch on and switch off when you put it on and mm -hmm. put it off. Like smart charging box, 
smart charging box, out connection, and wireless charging. See? Oh, wow. Wireless charging. Wireless charging audio product. That's good. Yeah. Very That's recent also. One of our high and the premium product line item. Mm. Okay, that's okay, that's okay, that's okay. Okay, our second product line is the basic entrance product line. Okay, which is mm -hmm. based on JL as the main chipset for mm -hmm. basic low at the entrance product market level. Like, so is that uh, for it's an entry level? It means it's more affordable. Is that it? Yep. Yes. Very basic. Uh, with some basic function, but the quality is reliable for entrance level end user. I mean, right. they don't want to pay a lot more, but they still want a TWS with reliable quality. Mm -hmm. You know, our market, there are several different levels, okay, for this entrance level. Like this item, our model T14. This is the one very typical one for our entrance level. Yeah. Right? For mm -hmm. this model, we shipped more than 3 million pieces only wow. for U.S. market in 2020. Because Walmart, the Black Friday, our item for their Black Friday. That's why for this entrance level product, we do it just for quantity sale. Okay. Right? As a factory, we have some basic cost to be covered. All right, so just for uh, example, and uh, the other one, this model here, our model number T19, T19. This is the latest economic entrance level for this year. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, it's not a copy from <laughs> AirPod Pro. It's not a copy, don't worry because we have our copyright in China. Okay. Okay. So if you want to compare, we can do some comparison. Mm -hmm. Here we have this one here, AirPod Pro. And our model here, two top T90. Look mm -hmm. at it. Side view, back view, front view, bottom, and top and bottom, USB-C, all right? Okay, USB-C, so yeah, standard. The earbuds itself, it's different. Uh, where is the camera? Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, we can see it, yes, thank you. That, right? Okay. Yeah, we can. Thank you. Thank you. Um, you know, well, time is so limited. There is a lot more to talk about, but I really mm -hmm. don't want to take too much time. Mm -hmm. um, everybody, you are warmly welcome to come to uh, visit us anytime. Yes. Okay, thank you. Thank you very much. I hope you a very nice weekend for you and your family. Bye-bye. Oh, um, okay. Thank you, Alan, David. Thank oh, okay. you, I guess. Way, Marie, do you <laughs> yes. have any questions about our product and our company? Yes. Um. So, are there any comments so far? Um. There, there, there aren't any questions so far. They're just saying nice things, like uh, Jane says, interesting wireless products. So yeah, he thinks your products are cool. And um, for my question thank you, for, uh, thank you. And then as a buyer, so what is the MOQ of uh the product you just showed? Wow, that's a cool question. Uh. You know, in this industry, um, we we are not gonna say uh, we are not going to say we are so big. But you know, uh, as a factory with more than one thousand five hundred employees, we do have our MOQ. Our MOQ is five thousand to start with. Why? Okay. Because for only one assembly line, one day, I mean, only eight hours, our capacity is three thousand and five hundred. So there is a hard cost to be covered. That's why mm -hmm. we set up our MOQ as 5,000 pieces. Thank you. I hope I um, answered your question, Arby. 
Oh yeah, you answered it loud and clear. So yeah, thank you. And also for explaining why your MOQ is 5,000. I'm sure uh, the buyers uh, can understand that. So thanks again, Alid and David. Okay, so now okay, let's- you're most welcome. Thank you. Okay, so now let's move on to Albert Wang of Skywing. So Albert, uh, show us uh, or tell us rather uh, your best products. Yes, uh, the, definitely. Thank, uh, thank you, RV. So uh, at Skywing, uh, one of our uh, core value in terms of uh, product emphasis is our uh, capability to uh, develop a Bluetooth audio product under the, uh, the Qualcomm uh, Bluetooth uh, technology. And, uh, yeah. and currently, we have uh, uh, we have done so with TWS, TWS was ANC feature, and also yeah. in the same time, uh, and also stereo headset and model. So uh, we have a very complete line, and um, our pri and currently, uh, we have over uh, 70, uh, 70 uh, uh, product development and also R and D, uh, all specialized in the Qual uh, Qualcomm solution. All right, Albert, so, so you mentioned Qualcomm. So tell us about um, the strength of having Qualcomm chipsets in your audio products. Yes, uh, definitely. Uh, obviously, uh, Qualcomm has uh, made, uh, made a very uh, strong push into uh, 2020 and now heading into 2021. So currently, they have, they have come out with several uh, chipset solution where at Skywing, we have mastered, uh, mastered that technology in terms of development. So in, in terms of... Um, in terms of uh, with qual uh, with uh, our TWS, for example, our currently uh, this model, uh, this mm -hmm. is a, a TWS model that we uh, we made up with the newest uh, Qualcomm uh, uh, 3040 technology, where it, yeah, it, wow. it is a uh, and also we also we are also in the uh, in the stage of developing a, uh, a hybrid ANC. So in the same time, uh, what makes Qualcomm different is number one, it's a uh, Qualcomm as uh, true wireless uh, technology. Uh, no, that definitely was uh, Qualcomm's true uh, true wireless technology, where uh, it has a, a very stable connection, so it doesn't fall off uh, that easily. And, uh, and obviously, second uh, second part, Qualcomm ha is uh, known and uh, to be one of the best when it comes down to uh, call voice. So currently, what I'm wearing, uh, I'm actually wearing a headset right now. Um, yeah. And, um, it, which is Bluetooth, and also it's uh, developed uh, under Qualcomm. And then, and then currently, I, I believe that you guys are hearing me very well. So this yes, is- Yes, uh, very clear audio indeed. <laughs> yes, yeah, so this is actually developed with uh, Qualcomm's uh, CDC hmm. with uh, ENC technology. So, and, and currently we are making this product for uh, tier one uh, communication brands uh, globally. So, so this kind of, so in the same time, um, obviously uh, with a lot of our business are being uh, you know, into the North America and also uh, the European market, yeah, everybody recognize uh, you know the uh, Qualcomm in terms of you know the name itself, the the name recognition, and also the the st stability, and and to and obviously to conclude this uh, this uh, question, what uh, why Qualcomm, why Skywing? Because yeah. Qualcomm uh, it has been known to be uh, very expensive in the past, and now uh, so Qualcomm's heading into this market uh, very strong, and obviously at Skywing we, we partner up with. Uh, uh, Qualcomm directly, where now the uh, the price point are coming down very aggressively. Where mm. I, uh, an A and C product, I mean, you could probably see it in retail for less than a hundred dollar yeah. uh, in terms of uh, so in the uh, in the in the uh, in the retail space. Yeah. So uh, yeah, yeah. So definitely, if you guys have any uh, questions, you know, obviously feel free because uh, we since uh, we have. We, you know, since 2003, we have been focusing on CSR and uh, Qualcomm Bluetooth technology since then. So, yeah. So, uh, if you have any questions, uh, any comments. Yes, you know, comments, questions, guys. Uh, please share them in the, the comment section below. But so, Albert, I have a question. So, um, please elaborate further on ANC and why do you think it's a very trending feature that buyers should source? Yes, uh, definitely was a uh, ANC. Uh, uh, this uh, uh, this whole uh, burst obviously mm -hmm. came out from uh, the emergence of uh, Apple. Uh, Apple yeah, the uh, AirPods. AirPods. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So imagine. Uh, so you know, when you're in a very lo uh, loud environment and you want to enjoy your music, mm -hmm. and, then, and 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 then that's this is where ANC kicks in. You know, to yeah. block out those uh, noises. So if you're a, a music lover, you can definitely you know enjoy ANC uh, uh, function. 
And and obviously, uh, one thing I would like to also elaborate is also there is a technology called ENC, which is mm -hmm. uh, noise cancellation, where this is also uh, something that I'm using right now. So where, you know, you're in a loud environment and you also wants to, uh, want to have a, a clear communication with uh, people talking, you know, on the other side. And this is mm -hmm. kind of, uh, so this is also a, a must, uh, you know. Yeah. So right now, what we're seeing in the market right now is not only you're uh, going after ANC, so you're also at, um, after ENC as well. Thank you. And um, your company has both features, yes, and also a Qualcomm chipset. Yes. That's good to know, guys. Keep out. So Steph has a, a question. She thinks your products are cool, and she's asking if um, you offer products with anti-lost and anti-theft features. Are they already around in uh, your wireless earbuds? Anyone can answer. Uh, uh, currently not, but uh, this is mm -hmm. a good idea. We will we, yeah. definitely uh, agree. Think of a way. <laughs> we'll we'll definitely think of a way to uh, implement it. Yes, definitely. Thanks, Steph, for that question. It's very insightful. Yeah, I, it makes me excited of what further advancements uh, wireless earbuds have in store. Okay, so are there any more questions? None? Okay, so let's move on to um, Alice and Fairy. So uh, please uh, share details of your best product. Hello, I, I want to introduce our company, the TWS Airbus, to the customers. This model name is X15, and mm -hmm. this model using the PCB chipset is uh, PIX8 16035F, uh, and this model also support uh, ENC. The ENC the chipset is PIX8 1606. The, this, this model, the, the TWS, the frequency response is 20 to 20. Thousand K uh, HZ, mm -hmm. and uh, this this product also support the wireless charge. The wireless, wireless charge, good. yes, the wireless charge increment three point five hours. Charge this product. This product will be uh, stay in a uh, full capacity battery stage. And uh, X five the uh, charging box weight is thirty nine point six. G and the airbus airbus weight is 3.9 G so it's very comfortable for wear because the product is large and the air the, the air from the battery is 40 mh and the charging box is 380 mh mm -hmm. the working timing of the uh, single charge is 4 hours the charging time of the airphone is 1 hour the charging time of the charging box is 4 around one hour. The, the full part is sound. The uh, no speaker, 10 mm full frequency, call your drivers. And the frequency response is 20 HZ to 20 K HZ. And the output is 5 MW. And uh, this model also support uh, IPX5 water resistance. Yeah, water no worry. Resistance. Daily, daily use. Spl uh, splash, ring, or switch. When you when you join the uh, sport of of the, the weather is raining, this is mm -hmm. IPX5 water resistance. Yeah. Uh, so uh, so the last sum uh, summary I want to uh, submit to the X5 TW as air airbrush uh, and advantage and management. The open and the use wireless charge. The sound sounds is stereo, and the, the Bluetooth version is 5.0. HD phone call, IPX5, single or dual use, comfortable wearing because it's night, nice. because the the product weight is night. Nice. Okay, thank you. My presentation is over. Any question? Guys, any questions? Uh, none so far. So I will ask, what's the MOQ for your product? Uh, our MOQ is a 3K for OEM. OEM. All right. So uh, you support logo engraving and also colors, color options. Uh, uh, we have two colors. One is black, one is mm -hmm. white. 
and the three K is for one color se selection. Oh, all right, all right. Um, so yeah, I, our buyers got yeah. that. Maybe you can make an order five K. I can offer two colors. Oh wow! Okay, guys. So black and white. Uh, choose your pick. Which uh color you want to source? Okay. So thank you, Fairy. So um, next up is Paul of you and I. Paul, show us your best product. Yeah, it's my turn finally. Okay. Hey. So nowadays, of course, uh, I would like to introduce uh, our product level, but different levels. We have a high, we have a middle, we have entry levels. Uh, I'm wearing my middle level talk with you. What about the results? You can hear me very clearly? Yes, the audio is uh, loud and clear. Yeah, yes. Uh, this, I, I, I take it off. Yeah, this one is uh, what do we have. Uh, this is with the ANC. Uh, with not only ANC, ENC, but also we are special is with gaming inside, with gaming mode. Oh, what does so, that mean? Yeah, this gaming you can uh, you can choose uh, mm -hmm. you can choose different uh, level and uh, make it uh, low latency when you play a oh, game. Wow. So you got a very good experience. Mm -hmm. So this our first to bring this concept to the market. So we are innovation company. So we always build in new concept to make it different. So uh, this is uh, our uh, middle level only. But mm -hmm. another thing, another thing is this is this is very comfortable because uh, you're wearing it and uh, got the pain for all day. You got no pain, no pain oh. for all day. So it's you know, ergonomic. As, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, the design. The design is very unique. So mm -hmm. when you put it in the ear, you just uh, uh, wearing like nothing, mm. and very comfortable. So you can wearing for whole days, and uh, you can got ANC result, but no painting, no painting. So this is our mid level called uh, two nine nine. Yes, our this is our patent, our own patent. Oh, patent. And also. Yes, we have also this our own patent one. This is high level one. We use it. Uh, we got this model. We got the red dot uh, award this year for the design. You know the good design. We got the red dot award. Oh, congrats! From Germany. <laughs> Thank you. And this one, and of course, it's a hybrid ANC with three mics. Uh, mm. One mic here. One mic here and one mic here. So three mics. So make you very clearly when you talk with others, yeah. the other side and the ENC and can reduce active noise cancellation, can reduce the, the low frequency noise from your side. So also mm. it's very comfortable and very comfortable this design and very soft. Yeah. the. We can uh, reach uh, even we reach forty dB, you know. Wow! <laughs> reduce, yeah, reduce the, the until the forty dB, reduce the uh, noise. Yeah, the outer so, noise, which is yeah, important yeah. a lot. It's trending very much. Yeah, yeah, it's it's marvelous products and they're very popular mm. and also very popular because it's a hybrid and uh, yeah, of course uh, we, we we now we do uh, use. Uh, some uh, like uh, Colorcom. We, we we have several, not only one solutions inside. We can use Colorcom. We can use uh, also. We can use the uh, Aroha and even BES. Mm. So we can all use it. Oh, and, so you use uh, multiple chipsets? Am I correct? You use a variety yeah. of chipsets. Oh, a lot of options then <laughs> for buyers. Pardon me? So um, you use various chipsets. Uh, so that means buyers have uh, different price range options, correct? Yeah. Yeah, you can, yeah, option. So you can, I, I have, I can see one of the uh, clients uh, uh, give me a questions, right? 
Yes, yes. So Cecilia, yeah. So um, Cecilia thinks that you guys have interesting uh, wireless earbuds for gaming. So that's a niche um, yeah. product which is really interesting. So she's asking how much battery power do they pack, and then how many hours can you use the earphones from, and also what is the charging time? Yeah. Uh, for 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 this one, for example, for this one. Uh, for my one, uh, I use the uh, in in the ear buds, in the ear buds, we use forty five mAh batteries. Okay. Yeah. For and uh, can can last in about four hours. Yeah. Four same, hours. Same, about, yeah, listen to music about four hours, and then we are charging it so one one and uh, one and a half an hour, so we can charge it. Oh, two. that's uh, yeah, it's quick yeah, actually. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. That's, that's I, I think for the uh, uh, human use and the paper mm -hmm. use, it, I think it's quite enough because yeah. ours, this one is very small. You can see it's very small and comfortable. Mm -hmm. So that's why we use the button. We use the button batteries inside. It's, okay. you know, the, yeah, the button batteries inside. So it's very compact and a very uh, right. high capacity. Yeah. And, All right, and thank the, you, Paul. Yeah, yeah, and the last, I would like to introduce our entry level one. Mm -hmm. Even how we do the entry level one, we are very mini and very fashion. This very mini and very very popular nowadays. And even we do the entry level one, we do different with others. Because we're not only the price attractive, but also, also the quality. Because uh, we would like to do the quality level, not only entry level but also at least the middle level. So it's, it's different. So not only the size, mm -hmm. yeah, mini, yeah, but also the sound quality is very good. So we use it 14.2 uh, diameters of the speaker. Okay, so, so interesting. Yeah, so uh, tiny but mighty. So uh, Milan has yeah. a question Thank here. You. Um, he wants you to further explain the gaming point of your wireless wireless earbuds. Like, how do you call it? Like a gaming wireless earbuds. Um, what are the features it includes? Can you expound on that? Okay, I will explain a little bit. Uh, because uh, you know, uh. Uh, many young, uh, young guys, when you uh, go outside to play game with your uh, with your mobile, so uh, a wire or Bluetooth, and uh, uh, you want to play a game. But nowadays, the main things is uh, low latency. Uh, yeah. So uh, what's low latency it, yeah. for our buyers? Yeah. For example, when you when you see the guy shooting another one, but the sound. You got the sound is very late. Mm -hmm. The picture is already action, but then you hear your the sound from the video from your gaming is latency. Do you understand what I mean? It's 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 very late. You know. Yeah. The sound so there's no delay. So yeah, it's not the same step. It's not the same step. It's not the mean mean at the same same time. So if right. this one can be transferred to that gaming mode, gaming mode, mm -hmm. so this can be get get rid of it. I mean, this can be the same same time. It's no different. It's no different. Great. All right. Thank you, Paul, for answering uh, Milan's question. Um. Yeah. So um, that was Paul's answer. So now, you guys, um, let's end this uh, live stream with a short and sweet message to the buyers. So in one minute or less, as a buyer, why should I source from your company? So let's start with Alan and David. You guys are muted, so please unmute yourself then. Um, yeah. Well, answering this question, if you're sourcing for my company and put us to be your business partner, we assure you will make more profit money. That's it. Thank you. 
<laughs> so guys, um, buyers looking to increase your sales, do contact Shenzhen and do tough. Okay, next yes. is Albert Wang. As a buyer, why should I source from Skywing Communication? Are you please yes, give me a second? I hope you can contact us for more information because right here, time is so limited. This is my contacts. All right, guys, screenshot. I'm sure uh, they can screenshot. The yes, they got it. Got it. And okay. um, guys, for the viewers okay. there, um, their homepage is also linked in the description below. So you can contact all of these four amazing suppliers. Thanks, Alan and David. Thank you, Arvi. Thank you, everybody. Have a nice day. Okay, um, and then let's move on to Albert. So um, tell us about Skywing, the benefits for buyers. Yes, yeah, so definitely uh, at Skywing, uh, we have been in business uh, since 2003. And uh, uh, literally 90%, uh, 99% of our business are exporting. So we understand the market of uh, North America and also uh, Europe and also uh, various different regions. We have uh, done business in the past with you know, uh, mass retail, national retail the distribution brand. so uh to us our our, our added value is our uh, understanding of uh, uh market channel so mm -hmm. we understand what your uh, what your customer what your uh sales channel required and we will uh, work with you and come up with a, a a suitable solution for you to be successful thank you yeah, that's interesting because as a buyer, I can uh, also um, gain market insights. You guys are going to teach me which markets should I sell. And is that right? You're also going to suggest which products uh, you guys have that I can source and um, sell to a specific region because you guys understand the market. Uh, yes. I mean, uh, we, we have worked with customers in, in the past where they start out small and then now mm -hmm. they're... Uh, and, and a lot of them are uh, we have done business with them over ten years, and and now they are very reputable in a particular uh, expertise area, region, market. So this is definitely uh, we will pass on our experience. At the same time, we will also love to learn from the customer where your uh, what where your market base is, and also what your customer is looking for, and we will all sit down together and uh, figure out the team plan. All right, thanks, Albert. All right, so let's move on to Alice and Ferry. Um, in one minute or less, why Shenzhen Diadem? Why should I source from you? Hello, can everybody hear us? Ah, yes, we can hear you. Go ahead. Hello? Yes, uh, Alice, we can hear you. Go ahead. Sorry, our internet connections are not very stable, and uh, I would like to to say that our company have over 13 years experience, and we have very mm -hmm. experienced uh, R&D team and manufacturing. We've got over 30,000 30, uh, square meters self-built factory in England. So uh, believe us, we will provide you the best, best product and uh, experience. Okay, thank you, Alice of Shenzhen Diadem. Uh, last, Paul of Guangzhou UNI, why should we source from your company? Yeah, yeah. Uh, here I would like to give you uh, one example. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, this kind of products is from us, but it's a brand name, it's SoftBank. So why, I just would like to give you an example, why SoftBank choose us? We are the first company, uh, Bluetooth company in China. Why they choose us? So first, uh, of course, the quality, of course. Yeah, because Japanese, you know, it's very, very strict on the quality. Mm, agree. Of course, it's not enough. They found, oh, we have also very attractive price. Okay, price performance is the base, I think. But it's also not enough. So we are the innovation guy. They found, oh, one of the products, you have the patent. The patent is not only the ID, it's all, not only your utility, but also it's invention. You have a patent of invention patent. The patent name is Forever Smart. 
So we have an innovation guy. So we have a patent, invention patent. So they found this can bring a value to the consumer. So they give the project to us to develop this to them. Mm-hmm. And this, we develop this, we help them to get the red dot, the award, and also this kind of products are selling all over Japan, becoming number one rank in mm, the wow. Japan at that time. Yeah, I can show you the products. All right. Yeah. Okay. So, um, for for yeah. buyers who all want to check your award winning products, um, guys, uh, click on the description below. All their home pages under global sources are available. So yeah, thank you so much, um, yeah. guys. Thank you for appearing in Analyst Choice. It's been a pleasure um, learning about your company and products. And we wish you the best. We wish you more sales and more success in your company. Thank you. No, thank you very, thank much. You very much. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Bye-bye. 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 Okay, guys. So that was... Um, our guest suppliers for today and um i hope you guys love the products that they showed as much as we loved like watching them they're really really cool and very relevant for today so um please again please do source from our companies their homepage links are down in the description below and may you all have a good day bye 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 guys bye bye see you next time See you. See you next time.